Hello, and thank you for joining me in another lesson in Sage X3. In today's lecture, what we're going to be taking a look at is how to go about and to delete a delivery record that was generated in the X3 system. Now, so the delivery, that's part of the sales order fulfillment process within X3. That process being generating a sales order, allocating inventory against the sales order, creating your picking tickets, creating your delivery records, validating the delivery record, generating the invoice, and validating the invoice. Okay, so as it relates to the delivery record itself, you have the delivery in both a validated and an unvalidated state. So when the delivery record is initially generated from the sales order or from the picking ticket, it's in an unvalidated state. And while the delivery record is unvalidated, if you so determined there was a mistake and you wanted to, to delete it, you could simply come over here into the right panel and click on your delete button. But if your delivery record has already been validated and the delivery record has not been invoiced as of yet, and you can tell that from the delivery record with this check uh, box not being set in the invoice number field being blank. In these cases, when you want to delete the delivery, the way that you have to go about it is through the line level, okay? Because you can see how our delete button is deactivated. So for this particular delivery record 50 that I have here, if I come to the line, click on the action button, then I'm going to come to modification of issues. Then in here, I'm going to set the to ship field to zero in tab. I get a little warning message saying that this document line is going to be deleted. I say OK and close. And now I can see that the one line item is removed. Then I can come down, modification of issues on the second line, blanket the two ship out, say OK, save the change. OK. Whoops, I think on my first line I, I did a close page as a terms versus a save. So let me do that again. Modification of issues. Set the two ship to zero, OK, then save. OK, and now the delivery record has been deleted in full. OK, so that's it for the lesson here today. I hope that this video is of help to you. If so, I'd ask you to please to remember to like and subscribe. And as always, if you have any questions, you can feel free to inbox me. Thanks again.